All right. Super thing shout outs go to at Jeremy Stewart 1785. Love the light kit. Got to replace mine. One decent collision took out my front. Thanks for letting us know. Then we have at Michael Van Kurt 3576 supporting each and every video. I definitely do appreciate all the support and love you show to this channel. Then we have at Ben and Drum 75. Thanks for making videos. Well, I appreciate you guys watching them and supporting. Then we have at Jeremy Stewart 1785 supporting many, many videos. Definitely those that do support and can support. I really do appreciate it. Now on to today's video. All right, welcome back. So today got the Outcast 4S out here on a trail. We're gonna go ahead and give uh, this uh, old place I used to bash at a while ago a rip with the 4S Outcast uh, version 2.5 and we'll see how this thing does. Haven't been out here in a little while because the last time I was here, area was overgrown. I have a feeling it's gonna still be this way, but figure kick on the camera. Some rabbits running out here. Yeah, the whole place is just so overgrown where I used to bash. All the jumps are just riddled in weeds. It's just sad to see it this way now. I'm gonna kick off the camera, clean up some of these weeds. God, that camera wiggles a lot out here. I think it's going to last one jump. <laughs> Trying to clean up this landing. I don't even think I have a enough speed. I'd have to clear a, a path through here now. <laughs> I didn't think that camera would last. It bounced off somewhere. I think you would be able to find the whole camera mount. But let me kick the camera off and find the, the GoPro. Be right back. All right, found the GoPro. That thing went flying. <laughs> I'm never going to make it across. Might have to go get the X-Max. Clear a path for this little guy. Yeah, 
it used to run up here all the time. So the path was pretty much cut all the time. It's just too much for this little guy. jump is just too much for this little guy. Believe it or not, there's a jump right there too. Poor little guy. The rocks are just too much. The weeds are too tall. Sun is right in my eyes. That is not getting out of there. Got to be careful with snakes. Christmas trees. Need to get a fifth scale out here and clear all this stuff. Too much for this little guy. I got all the bugs flying now.
center diff definitely is a weird experience with this. Front tires are just ballooning until it sets down. Where the slipper clutch would eventually lock up, this just continues to fall. So I'm probably gonna have to add some thicker center diff fluid because on my stunt truck, I definitely like it uh, to drive more off the rear. God, those front tires look like they're gonna blow up. It's full trigger all the way down. Uphill, it tends to slow. <laughs> Funny. Nice angled curb right there. Try to get my shadow out of it. Oh, there's no ABC on this thing. curbs not slant it nope figure both sides would have been the same <laughs> right on its lid Such a soft start. That was weird. Definitely got to up the punch. Because butted against it, normally I pull full trigger, but it hesitates. Oh, right on that front. Diffs out so easy. Definitely a different driving style. Gotta tap the brakes to get it to turn. Or it just pushes right through the steering. Low voltage cut. Full trigger all the way back. Interesting. I did bring some more packs, but 
think I'm gonna call it for this location. It's just still too overgrown for the smaller RC cars, even the bigger RC cars. But anytime I can get out and rip, it's definitely fun. I use bags for batteries. Still has that new plastic smell. New electronic burning smell. But there we go. Poor little 4S. Out here just trying to be a big dog. But there we go. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if uh, you ripped the new 2.5 Outcast. And uh, how do you like it? Is it something uh, better than the 2.0 version with the slipper clutch? Or you haven't experienced both? I can definitely tell you this, it's, it's really a different experience. But like, comment, subscribe. We'll catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching.